God bless you all. Dave here to tell you about how you can achieve your goals. You know, Proverbs in the Bible tells us a lot about goals. And I'll read you three scriptures. And the three scriptures are first, Proverbs 16, 9. Second is Proverbs 19, 21. And the last is Proverbs 21, 5. Let me read the first one. In Proverbs 16, 9, the scripture reads, In the hearts humans plan their course, but the Lord establishes their steps. And in Proverbs 19, 21, many are the plans in a person's heart, but it is the Lord's purpose that prevails. And the third one, Proverbs 21, 5, says the plans of the diligent lead to profit as surely as haste leads to poverty. Let's talk about how we can do our part to prepare and plan and perform our goals. There are four steps to achieve your goals. The first one is to write them down, to know what they are. The second one is to believe in yourself because no one else will. The third one is a future investment. Again, no one's going to invest you in you. You need to invest in yourself. And the fourth one is quite simply to take action. So let's talk about them. Number one, to write down your goals. Brainstorm a list of goals for the day, for the week, for the year, whatever it may be, whatever your planning process is. After you brainstorm, you'll have this huge list. Circle the ones that are most important. Those will be your priority. So first you brainstorm a list, and then after you have this huge list, circle the ones that you find to be most important. Number two, create a powerful belief system. Others trust you, so you can too. But the only one who really trusts yourself is yourself. Make the choice to believe in yourself. Now, as I said before, people trust you if you trust yourself first. So people can trust you, but that only happens if you trust yourself first. Next, be around good company because those are the people that will trust you. Bad people create bad environments. Number three, invest in yourself. One of the world's greatest investors is Warren Buffett. And he said that the best possible investment is to invest in yourself. Be wise in your learning. Read books, take a class, do something to learn. Also keep your brain active by keeping yourself physically active. Be fit, eat well, exercise. And number four, take action. Do not procrastinate. Be led by the Holy Spirit. Don't be afraid as God is with you. But most importantly, just move forward. It was President Abraham Lincoln who said, I walk slowly, but I never walk backward. He is saying that whatever you do, keep doing it and just keep moving forward to make progress. So in summary, here is how to reach your goals. Number one, write your goals. Number two, believe in yourself. Number three, think about that future investment. And number four, take action. And once again, take a moment to read the Bible and meditate on Proverbs chapter 16, verse 9, and also Proverbs chapter 19, verse 21, and also Proverbs chapter 21, verse 5. My name is Dave, and thank you for watching.